across. You're gonna eat that, no, right? No, get away from me. Look. You're gonna eat it, right? Of course. Yeah. Huh? I'm gonna oh, pass. Yeah. You don't, sure don't want one. I'll bark. I think my stomach's kind of hurting. All right. You want to really gross through that out? Eat the one that's a, a dead fish that fell on the ground. Tastes like footprint. Oh, yeah. Let's not do that one. Oh. Kinds of goodies in there. Special offers, especially for you. Look inside. Hearing aid. Bifocals. Adult diapers. <laughs> yeah. All right. So this is something that's pretty darn special and cool. Watch what I got here. Just like the chest set, little frame there. Individual pieces of leather. How about that, boys and girls? Dice rollers. Got little pieces. See, we just sewed it, hand sewed it, all the way down here like this. Isn't that cool? Here we go. There we go. Got ourselves a backgammon set, a really cool one. I'm not sure if children this age are used to even knowing what this contraption is but my daughter what is this called sis what is this thing a typewriter a typewriter for people my age everyone had a typewriter but for e people your age nobody has a typewriter <laughs> except Stella Bunsen look practicing huh um I'm writing like a story for Cross. Cross wants me to write a story. So sweet. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with these dogs? Is it time? It's not time. You just need to go outside. No. 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 Oh, these dogs are fat. Go outside. So, most of you already know that I work from home, and um, that I consider an incredible blessing. And I know many mothers would die to be able to have a job like that and so I'm very blessed um but recently with some changes in our businesses I really feel the need to be in the offices more and interacting with our people and um just being leading by example so um I didn't feel like giving up my time away from my children I feel as a mother and a business owner um that it's incredibly important to place my children as a priority and over my job. So I decided that the only way to accommodate both and not give up my availability to my children and yet continue to be available to those who need me at work was to bring them here. So if you don't know, my children are homeschooled. I'm very blessed to be able to do that too. And so I just thought, you know what, I'm going to turn one of the offices into their homeschooling room. So I pretty much finished it. Um, I've got to get a clock in between those two picks right there. But other than that, I think we're done. This is a little uh, reading nook area. Just got these really cool chairs in that actually adjust into five positions and lay flat. And they're super comfy. And then, of course, just some of their adventures with mom and dad. And, of course, some learning material. And a chalkboard but also let all things all that you do be done in love and uh, we'll be starting here tomorrow I'm super excited about that my kiddos will be here with me tomorrow and my office is right next door which I haven't even started decorating because this is a new office space for us and uh, so anyhow I'm excited to have them here so all that to say don't 
let your work be your priority. Let your children and your family be. Yeah.